Located in a renovated brick villa from 1891 that used to be a pharmacy, the Samuel is named after his son, who helped design the logo. Chef Jonathan Bernstein opened the Samuel in 2019 with a strong focus on aged cheeses and vintage wine pairings, and was awarded a Michelin star just four months after opening. Good evening. Hello. You're going to start off with some butter. You have some uh, floral butter with some different kinds of dried flowers and a little fleur of the scent. Then you have some uh, fromage fraiche with roasted green anise seeds and a freshly pressed olive oil from Italy. Then I've baked a selection of bread for you. We have some uh, brioche rolls, some Manitoba bread made with equal amounts of water and flour. I also put uh, lots of uh, parmigiano. And I've made some olive tapenade rolls. I believe it's good. It's a, an amuse bouche that consists of some double creme fraiche, a little lemon olive oil, some poached razor clams, a little uh, berry caviar from Madagascar, and a twin on top. From 1986, from a small area called Sillenberg, which is in Requier in Alsace in France. After tasting the 98 Guy Michel Fils with our first course, we realized how special this wine pairing was going to be. This followed with the exquisite 86 Gewürztraminer demeanor that had aged lychee, honey, pineapple, and mango notes, pairing perfectly with the delicate butter poached langoustine and beurre blanc. Moi Champagne from the house called André Clé, which is one of the oldest families that we have in the Champagne district, dated back to 1741. This is the chiffler, filled with the uh, Norwegian scallops as a souffle. And then in the bottom, you have a very creamy, rich, but mild tomato sauce and some herbs on top. Thank you. Enjoy. So the next wine you guys are having is a German Riesling Spärglese, which means lead harvest grapes. The wine pairings just kept getting better. This perfect vintage Riesling tasted of petrol, apricot, and had a late harvest quality that just blew me away. Frankly, almost distracting from the goose liver parfait. It was so good. Red Burgundy from 1996, 100% Pinot Noir from uh, wines that are between 50 and 70 years old. From Maison de Langouche from the Bourne district. Cannelloni filled with the turbot. Mm -hmm. Then we got two sauces, one on the fish bowl on the, of the turbot, the light one, the dark one, a little bit more heavy, with some moles. And of course, carry on top. Enjoy. Thank you. You're welcome. Chef Bernstein has said he uses his wine as a starting point for every dish on the menu. The food is produce focused and quality driven, rather than complex and innovative, making the wine pairing the star of the evening for us, and by far the best wine we've had to date. We were taken downstairs after the main meal to learn about the process behind curating and aging their beautifully sourced cheese selection. The explanation of their product was detailed and probably not for everyone, but was another real highlight for us and would be an absolute pleasure for anyone interested in learning about their unique process and level of effort put into this course. You're going to start with a saint Maur cheese. These are goat's milk cheeses and they are rolled in ash. This one is called Ovelier because of the shape, it's oval. You can see the aging process on the outside of the cheese. It's uh, started to age quite nicely. It's starting to get a little creamy, it's still quite fresh in the middle. And this cheese produces uh, these nutty notes, which are very uh, characteristic for goat's milk cheeses. So the young wine I'm pairing, the Pinot Gris from 2001, from Domains in Hindrick. So we're back in the Alsace district. A cognac-based sweet wine from 1989. 20% cognac, 80% grape juice from Dissertone district. 
only 17.5% of alcohol, even though it smells just like a regular cognac of about the 40%. Flavor-wise, just like a sweet wine from the Sutern district, but not as sweet as you normally would get them. Plenty of um, roasted nuts, apricot, peaches, pineapple, mango, saffron. Southam chocolate. Then you have these small pools. They consist of uh, some uh, chocolate ganache and uh, orange caramel. Thank you. 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 Thank you.